Mira que sexy la niña Norma, ve. Oh. Ay, hi, Edma. Ah, Hello, no molesté. Déjese ver. Déjese ver, usted, quiero ver. Hello, good evening, teacher. Ah. O sea, hello. The people in blue. Yes. <laughs> ah, Ay, el teacher. O sea, hello. Hola, <laughs> teacher. Excuse me. <laughs> teacher, take a picture, we are ready. <laughs> We will take a picture. We're just going to wait for the rest of your classmates. So, how are you feeling today? Now that it's Friday and you are about to relax on the weekend, what's your plan for the weekend? Edma? Hi, teachers. Good Hello. evening. Good evening. <laughs> My plan. Uh, Wait, yeah. you will fly? <laughs> Tomorrow, I, I'm going to visit, you know. Yeah. How do you say conocer? I can teach you. You can say I'm going to visit. Okay. Mm, pero lo podemos ver en algún lugar. We will have a meeting. Okay. <laughs> ah, okay. So tomorrow you're having a meeting. Okay, with your classmates. Yes, teacher. This is a plan. Okay, that's so nice. Thank you, teacher. Would you like okay. to go? <laughs> okay, welcome, Oscar, Melvin, Susana, Nelson. Uh, Jorge, Norma, Lisano, right? Isaura, Edna, Freddy. Good evening. Okay, Norma, what's your plan for the weekend? I don't plan any. You don't have any plans? No. Maybe I you don't. can say like, oh, on this weekend, I'm just going to stay home. Do some housework, watch some movies or series, relax a little bit, rest, sleep a lot. What the plan is go visit my family. You're going to visit your family. Nice. Yes. All right. Isaura? <laughs> it's the same thing with Elma and Brandy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> but that plan, but that meeting is just tomorrow, for example, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay. What about Sunday? Do you have any plan for Sunday? For Sunday, visit my parents. You're going to okay. So you say I'm yes. going to visit my parents, or oh, yeah. I'm visiting my parents. It's also possible to use the present continuous for for plans in the future. Okay. 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 Nice. Eh, uh, Brandy, what about you? How can I say? I'm going to work like every day. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, I'm going to work. It's just Nothing different. Work. Nothing special. No, nah, just apart for from tomorrow. the meeting. Just for tomorrow. The rest of the day, I always have to work. Okay, I got it. And figure out how to lose weight. <laughs> how to what? And I had to figure out how to lose weight. <laughs> okay. Well, if you think that's necessary, you will find a way. Not for me. Huh? Not for me, it's for the doctor. The doctor told you. Yeah, my husband. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> okay, that's specific information. Uh, let's listen to the next one. Uh, we have Nubia here. Welcome, Nubia. What's your plan for the weekend? Nubia. 
So yeah, can you use the microphone? Melvin? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. I'm going to watch uh, the Guardian de, Guardian de la Galaxia. Huh? I'm going to the cinema. Oh, you're going to, to watch a movie? Yes, I watch a movie. Nice. Okay, so you can you can give me some recommendations. If you think that is good or not, you can give me some feedback. I, I will watch okay. uh, Guardian de la Galaxia. Yes. I, the, in um, English, that would be the, the Guardians of the Galaxy. Guardian of the, the Guardians Galaxy. Of okay. The Galaxy. okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like the movie, but my favorite's number one, the first one. Mm, yes, it's good. But the, the third had, has good commentaries. Yeah, yeah. But we'll see. Uh, actually, about movies, there are a lot of good movies coming this, this month. And next month, Transformers, yes. uh, Fast and Furious, <laughs> Guardians of the Galaxy, The Flash. <laughs> yeah, a lot of good movies. Okay. Um, you, will, you will watch the movie on Spanish or on English? In Spanish. <laughs> yeah, the things that in, in the movies, you normally see the movies, I mean, they're usually in Spanish. Yeah. But when you watch, when I watch Netflix or other uh, sites, I I switch. Sometimes I watch them in Spanish. Sometimes I watch them in English. Yeah, I try to uh, use both. Uh, let's see who else. Jorge, good evening. Jorge, are you there? Okay, I'm not sure if Jorge has any problems. Teacher, sure, sorry, microphone. sorry, teacher. Okay, yeah. go ahead. What's your plan for the weekend, Jorge? Okay, uh, I don't have plans, but I, I'm going to stay in the home. Uh, I have faith in my children because my wife will be watching. You. Okay. Got it. Um, let's see. Who else? Thank you for sharing, Jorge. The next volunteer is, I'm not sure, Edwin or Nelson. Can you use your microphones? Yes, coach. So, what's your plan for the weekend? I'm going to watch to Real Madrid, coach. Okay. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, in La Liga, right? Oh, no, no, they're playing the final. Yes, it's the final. In the King's Cup. Okay, got yes, it. In the King's Cup. Yeah, Real Madrid has good matches this, these days. Next week, they yeah. are playing the Champions League. So yeah. The finals, right? The next Okay. Time. I hope, I hope that Manchester City wins, but yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so uh, thank you for sharing, Edwin. Good luck tomorrow on the, on the King's Cup. Now, uh, we're going to move on, and it's tongue twister time. So uh, we're going to get started with Betty Bottom. So the first volunteer will be... Ten, 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 ten. Who wants to be a volunteer? Norma, excellent. Yeah. Bárbara yes. Norma, o sea, hello. <laughs> Bye. Fast and Furious. Vamos a ver, vamos a buscar la imagen, teacher. Okay, okay. Hi, Sherry. Can you see the screen? Ah, okay. Hey, thank you. Come on, come in. Bye. Very bottom bow, but it. But the bar, very bottom bow was better. So, very bottom bow more better to make the bitter better. 
There you go. Excellent. Great job. Great job. Congratulations. Okay, so we already have the first volunteer. Who's next? And she was ready with her, her cup of water, you see? Okay. Next volunteer is ready. Me? Ready, set, go. Okay. Betty Bottom bought butter, but the butter Betty Bottom bought was bitter. So Betty Bottom bought more butter to make the bitter butter better. The bitter oh, butter wow. better. Excellent. There you go. <laughs> All right. That's the way you do it. And then we go with the next one. And... Have you ever listened to that song? It's like hip hop and it says, this is how we do it. No, this oh, yeah. is how we do uh, yeah. it. Okay, so this is how you do it. <laughs> okay, <laughs> this is the way. Next volunteer. Let's go, let's go, come on. Me. Isaura. <laughs> I try. <laughs> Fine. If, you want, if you want some gargantinas I have here. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Okay. Very bottom bow water, but the water very bottom bow was bitter, so very bottom bow more butter to make the bitter butter better. There, that's it. <laughs> wow. Okay. That was like the flash. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, next one. Who's next? Who's Edma next? is missing. What happened, Edma? Okay, somebody sending the audio through WhatsApp. Mel Nelson says that. Me teacher. And Jenny is missing too. Okay, okay. Edma and uh, Edwin says that he's going to, no, Nelson said that he's going to send the audio mm -hmm. through WhatsApp. Okay, so we're going to see him and listen to him in WhatsApp. Yeah. Okay. Okay, Edma. Very bottle of bow, butter, but the. Sorry, teacher. Okay, you can start again. Don't worry. Okay, you can okay. start again. Please. Very bottle of bow, butter, but the butter. Very bottom bob was bitter, so very bottom bob more butter to make the bitter butter better. That, that's the way you do it. <laughs> I okay, saw it, nice. mom. Thumbs up for you. Okay. Um. Next one. And Carolina Jorge, is having some ready. problems to enter. For his turn. Okay, George. Okay, thank you. Uh, very bottom but butter, but the butter, very bottom both was bitter. So, very bottom both more butter to make the bitter butter better. And that's it. You got it. Thank you. So, we go with the Tara this time, and let's see if we have another volunteer. Let's see, let's see. Not sure if Melvin is going to be able to uh, participate. I think. Yes, I can. Yes, excellent, Melvin. Okay. Very bottom bow butter, but the water very bottom bow was bitter. So very bottom bow more butter to make the bitter butter better. Okay, and just like that. Okay, no more. Excellent. Thank you so much, uh, Melvin. We move on, and I think that we're going to have two or three volunteers more. Uh, I'm not sure if Susana wants to try it out, or Nubia, or Jose Luis. Okay, Nubia. Go ahead, please. Okay. Very bottom bow butter, but the butter, very bottom bow was bitter, so very bottom bow more butter to make the bitter butter better. To make the bitter butter better. That's it. Excellent. Thank you so much, Nuya. 
Nice job. And we are going to continue with Jose Luis. Thank you, Nubia. Okay, teacher. Good evening. First, Good evening. Uh, the worst word in the world is war. Very butter for butter for the butter. Very butter for was bitter. So very butter for more butter to make the bitter butter. I let I lo intentaré después, profe. Yeah, to make the bitter butter better. Yes, that's okay. it. Okay. You got it. And you mentioned that you, you read the number one too. So nice. Thank you so much, Jose Luis. And um, we're just going to be missing. I'm not sure if Susana will be able to participate. All right. Um, so if there is another volunteer, you can just raise your hand or open your microphone. And if you have friends with the microphone here, you can send the audio through WhatsApp, okay? So the idea is to practice, remember that. That's the most important. Now, uh, thank you for sharing. Uh, Randy, we're going to move on. And uh, the next part, as you remember, uh, we were going to practice the conversation. So I ask you to please just read the conversation, familiarize with it because today you were going to practice in the breaker rooms, right? So basically the conversation is about a, a quiz or a trivia, right? Rel uh, related to geography. And this is Mike and Wendy, right? So we have the little conversation there. Uh, yesterday I, I read the conversation for you and the conversation goes like this. Here's a geography quiz in, in the paper. When they say in the paper, in, in English, they refer to the newspaper, okay? Hey, did you read the paper? It's like, did you read the newspaper, right? Uh, oh, I love geography. Ask me the questions. Sure, first question. Which country is larger, China or Canada? I know, Canada is larger than China. Okay, next. What's the longest river in the Americas? Um, I think it's the Mississippi. Here's a hard one. Which country is more crowded? Monaco or Singapore? I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Okay, one more. Which South American capital city is the highest? La Paz, Quito, or Bogotá? Oh, that's easy. Bogotá is the highest. Is the highest okay so uh do you have any questions about pronunciation before you go to the breakout rooms and practice like right, teacher how do you pronounce uh larger how do you pronounce larger for example if you have doubts like so pronunciation larger. larger is larger okay larger for example or geography is geography okay so if you don't have any questions we go to the breakout rooms in pairs and you are going to practice the two roles okay first are mike and in the second practice you are wendy okay so you practice the two lines okay in the conversation um all right so I'm going to create the breakout rooms. We are 15 right now, but some of your classmates can use their microphone today, okay? Uh, because some of them are working or some of them have some problems. So in this case, we have, uh, let's see. Uh, I think Nelson, Oscar, uh, Susanna has a little problem, okay? And uh, the other person who wrote in the chat, I think it was Susie, I'm not so sure. Um, oh, okay, okay. Yeah, Nelson is uh, send the, the audio through WhatsApp. Wait a second, maybe you can listen to it. Anybody? 
All right. So that was the audio from Nelson. Excellent. Yeah, so you see the most important Ready. The most important is that we practice uh, and we try to find a solution, right, to the problems in order to practice the language. Now, let's move on. Uh, okay, we will have six breakout rooms. Hopefully, Evelyn is here. Evelyn, welcome. Uh, does your microphone work? Uh, so it is. Jenny is here too. Jenny, are you going to, to try to say the tongue twister or Jesus? Yes, teacher, I try. Okay, okay, go ahead, okay. please. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, Jesus. Okay, so we go with Jenny, then Evelyn, and then Jesus. Okay. Okay. Very bottom, but butter. But the Butter very bad about uh, uh, has bitter, so very bad about more butter to make the bitter butter better. That's it. Okay. You practice, Jenny. You practice. Excellent. Thank you so much, Evelyn. Uh, okay. Uh, sorry. <laughs> the mysterious girl. Okay. Um... Okay, so it's a travel language, right? Yeah, the yes. twister, yeah. correct. Okay, uh, very bottom body, but butters, but on the butter, very bottom body was bitter, so very bottom bout more. Better to make it the bitter bo butter better. <laughs> okay, that was a mix of British English and American English. Okay, like when you say Harry Potter, right? That's British English, and Harry Potter is American English. Excellent, thank you, Jenny. So you can say very bottom and butter. Okay, butter. Okay, butter. yeah, butter is more like uh, like British English, right? Okay, so <laughs> nice. And Jesus? Very bottom bag butter, but the butter very bottom bag was bite. So very bottom bag more butter to make the bitter better butter. The bitter butter butter. 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 Okay, there you that's it. Excellent. Thank you so much, uh Jesus. You did a great job. And now please take a screenshot of the conversation. Take a screenshot of the conversation, please, for practicing in the breakout rooms. Okay. Uh, I tape, I tape the, the chat, uh, this uh, conversation to a teacher. Okay, you send it to the chat. Mm, I can if you... <clears throat> If your screenshot is clear, I think it's not a problem. I will try to send it to you. Okay. So there you go. Ready? Um, I think everybody has a partner to practice. Uh, yes. Group. Room two, three is ready, four is ready, five ready, and six uh, is ready too. Yeah, I think we're, we're ready to go. All right. So, uh, See, yeah. So for this conversation, you will have just three minutes, okay? So you can practice the two times and then we'll come back. There you go. See you later. See you later, alligators.
Okay, Isaura, uh, you get the invitation to join the breakout room? Isaura, Edwin, and Susana. Okay, Edwin is in the breakout room, and Susana too. Isaura, you are the only one missing. Are you there? Right, so let's see. So it's a little issue with the microphone, probably. So I will go and practice with Jesus. I'm the only one. <laughs> yeah, now I'm here to practice with you. So let's do it. Hey, Mike. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Here's a geography quiz in the paper. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the questions. Sure. First question Which country is larger, China or Canada? I know. Canada is larger than China. Okay, next. What's the longest river in the Americas? Mm, I think it's the Mississippi. Here's a hard one. Which country is more crowded, Monaco or Singapore? I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Okay, one more. Which South America capital City is the highest, La Paz, Quito, or Bogota? Oh, that's easy. Bogota is the highest. Now we switch. Uh, here's a geography quiz in the paper. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the questions. Sure. First question Which country is larger, China or Canada? I know Canada is larger than China. Okay, next. What's the longest river in the Americas? Mm, I think it's the Mississippi. Here's a hard one. Um, which country is more crowded, Monaco or Singapore? I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Okay, one more. Which South American capital is city is the highest, La Paz, Quito, or Bogota? Oh. That's easy, but I the highest. Yes, that's correct. Isaura, <laughs> you're back. Okay, you did a great job, Jesus. Thank you for practicing. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Okay, we're going back to the main session. See you there. See you. Hey. Okay. Recording in progress. <laughs> okay, everybody's coming back. Let's okay, come so... back. Yes. All right, so uh, we got the chance to practice, okay? Now, because of time, we're going to move on to the next part of the session. That is to practice a little bit, well, to understand first and to practice a little bit about the topic on comparatives and superlatives. Okay, uh, so as I mentioned yesterday, we use comparatives when we have two or when we have more than two. That's right. What is correct? When I compare two. When you compare two, yes, that's correct. And superlatives is when we have I compare two or more, more things. Three two. or more. Three or more. <laughs> Three or more. Three or more. <laughs> All right, so let's take a look. 
Okay, we normally have the explanation first and then we have practice. But this time we're going to do practice first and then the explanation. Okay, we're going to do it do it in a different way. So okay. let's see the okay, the website. Wait up now. We can see the screen. Okay. So we have a little exercise here on so so sasa and susu. Okay, so this is comparative and superlative. Now, Sasa is in the middle, right? Sasa is longer than Susu, the shortest, the longest, or shorter than Susu? She is longer, the longer longest. than Susu. Longer than Susu. Than Susu. Yeah. Okay, Susu is... Ah, between both. Susu, Susu, Susu is... The shortest, shorter than Sozo. Okay. Then we have Sozo is longer than or the longest. The longest. The longest. Sozo is the longest. Yes. Yes. Okay. Más larga. Okay. And Susu is the? Shorter. The shortest. Ah. Service. Is the, the shortest. shortest. Service. Service. Okay. Service. Service. Let's continue. Exercise two. We have mm -hmm. Sam, Rose, and Lucas. Sam is 15, Rose is 20, and Lucas is 33. Oh. Now, Rose oh. is? Medio. Medio. Okay. Oldest. Younger than Lucas, because we compare two, yeah. right? Comparative, okay. Lucas, Lucas is older than, the oldest, the, oldest, younger. the youngest, or the younger oldest. than? Older than. Older than. Older than Sam. Older than Sam. So Lucas is older than Sam. Sam. Okay. Sam is? The youngest. The youngest. The youngest. The youngest. The youngest. And Lucas is the? The oldest. The oldest. Okay. Lucas is the oldest. Now, the rabbit, the dog, and the cat. So the rabbit is smaller, bigger, the biggest, the smallest. Smaller than, than the dog because we have yes. two. Yeah. The cat is the cat is bigger than the rabbit. It's bigger than the rabbit. Now the dog yeah. is the, the smallest biggest. or the biggest. The biggest. The biggest. The biggest. The biggest. The biggest. Mm -hmm. biggest hamburguesa carbon. Okay. <laughs> and then the rabbit is smaller. Yes. The smaller. The smallest. 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 Okay. The smallest. smallest. Now we check. And yes, you got a perfect score. Now, that's the way that we use this. Okay. That's the way that we use the Comparatives and superlatives. When we have two, it's comparatives. When we have more than two, it's superlative. So, um, and yesterday I asked you some examples, right? Now, in your opinion, which language is more difficult? English or Spanish? Spanish. 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 It's, it's because we speak Spanish, so English yes. is, is more yeah. difficult. But in reality, in Spanish reality, is more difficult than um, English. Mm -hmm. That's why. You want to know why? You want to know why? The reason is because Spanish is more complex than English. For example, verbs, the conjugation of the verbs. Just in English, for example, we say, I play, you play, we play, they play, she plays, he plays, it plays. 
okay, in the base form, in the present. In, in Spanish, we say, yo juego, tú juegas, él juega, nosotros jugamos, ellos juegan. Y eso juega. Okay, so we have around five or more different forms of the same verb. In English, we have two forms. Okay, so it's pretty simple. This it's is simple. nothing. This is nothing because if you go to uh, Colombia, the in the other countries, they call something different too. Yeah, imagine, imagine in the past, in the past, I played, you played, he played, we played, it's the same verb for all the pronouns. In Spanish is, yo jugué, tú jugaste, ellos jugaron, nosotros jugamos, eh, él jugó, right, ella jugó. So, eh, it's more difficult because you have more forms. In English, for example, we say uh, the ball, the table, the backpack, the student, the teacher, the uh, language, the water. But in Spanish, you need to learn when something is feminine and when something is masculine, right? No se dice, eh, for example, la, el mochila, se dice, la mochila. Ah, ok, ok, la mochila. So, la niño, no, el niño. Ah, ok. And then you start like, la, le, el, la. So, it's more complex, it's more complex, right? So, um, that's the reason why Spanish is more difficult. But, luckily for us, we speak Spanish. So we just need to learn English. The difficult, the different difficulty with English is probably in pronunciation. Okay, pronunciation is more difficult, but the language itself is more complex. In Spanish, is more complex than English. Now let's move on. Uh, after the conversation, you have the grammar focus, right? In the grammar focus, you see the comparatives okay. and superlatives okay. with adjectives. With okay. adjectives. Okay. So everybody, please. Jenny Mute. And repeat. Long. Longest. Longer. Longer. The longest. The longest. Yeah. Dry. 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 Dryer. 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 The driest. The driest. The driest. Big. 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 Bigger. 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 The biggest. The biggest. The biggest. Famous. 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 More famous. famous. More famous. famous. The most famous. The most, the most famous. famous. Beautiful. 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 More beautiful. More beautiful. The most beautiful. The most beautiful. The most beautiful. beautiful. Good. 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 Better. 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 The best. The best. The best. Is incorrect to say the best. more good or more better. Never say that, please. The good? <laughs> okay, don't say more good or more better. No. Good is the adjective, mm -hmm. better is a comparison or the comparative, and the best is a superlative. Okay? Now, mm -hmm. this is irregular comparative, right? Irregular comparative because mm -hmm. it's different. Normally, normally, in the comparatives, we only add ER. For example, we have, a, let's say the adjective slow, right? Slow. Okay, slow. To, make, to make the comparative, you are going to add ER. And you say slower. Slower. And we use the adverb then. Ad then. Okay? So, for example, uh, which car is slower? The Ferrari or the Toyota? 
Toyota. The Toyota is the Toyota is slower. slower than the Ferrari. Okay. So um now another example. Let's suppose that we are talking about the opposite. We have fast, the comparative. Faster. R, and we say faster, 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 faster than, right? So, who is faster? Who is faster? Okay, let's talk about superheroes. Who is faster, Batman or Superman? Superman is faster than. Superman is faster. Batman. 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 Okay. Batman. Batman. It's Batman. 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 Right? Uh, now, that's easy, right? Comparatives. Now, what happens? What happens with this is short adjectives, okay? The short adjectives, los adjetivos cortos. But when we have two or more syllables, normally we use more, more. For example, when we say uh, important, let's say important, okay? We don't say important term. No. no. We say in the comparative. More important. More important. More important. Okay. So in your opinion, what is more important? Money or love? Money or love? Money is more important than love. According to Shakira, I agree. Uh, uh, money is more. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, so money is more important than love. Love, or that's opinion some people have. But yeah. obviously, some people will think, well, love is more important than money. It's about it's about opinions, right? Now we say more. Okay, we say more, more. important. That more important, important. than okay. We use the always, always Thanks. use them. Then okay. Now, um, popular. Okay, what is more? Which food? Which food is more popular in El Salvador? Mexican yeah. food or Chinese food? Mexican, Mexican food is more popular is more popular than the Chinese food. Now, which food is more delicious in your opinion? Mexican or Chinese? For me, Chinese food is Okay, so more for some delicious. people, Chinese is more delicious. For some delicious people, Mexican is more delicious. Mexican food. Okay. It's just about, op about opinions, right? Now, that's comparatives. What happens with superlatives? Okay, imagine that we have three options. Mexican food, Chinese food, and Italian food, which is the most popular food in El Salvador? Which is the most popular food in El Salvador? The most, the most, the most popular. popular food is always Mexican food. <laughs> the most popular food in El Salvador? Is, is Mexican food. Mexican food. Okay, it's Mexican food. So if you see the most popular, okay? Most popular. So we have three options, but from the three options, one is at the top, right? And that is Mexico. So uh, now when the adjective is long, but what happens if the adjective is short? The pasos y los adjetivos son cortos. Okay, let's go back to the example of fast. Fast. Normally, uh, normally for the short adjectives in the superlative, we use EST. EST. So we say 
the fastest. Awesome. The fastest. Okay? The fastest. Now, let's suppose, let's suppose that we have um, a motorcycle, a bicycle, and a Formula One car. Formula One car. Okay. Which is the fastest? The motorcycle, the bicycle, or the Formula One car? Just, you didn't I say the you didn't one say one the engine of the bike. It's the fastest. <laughs> <laughs> the fastest. Fastest is Formula Well mm -hmm. One Car. Formula One car is the fastest. fastest. Okay. It's the fastest of the three. Okay. So uh, now in this case we see the example, right? That uh, it's a short adjective. So we say the fastest. Now uh, what is the most, let's suppose, the most famous Salvadorian food? The, the pupusa. Is the most the pupusas. famous. Okay, yeah, that is the most famous Salvadorian food. Correct, mm -hmm. the pupusa. Now, what is the most famous drink, Salvadorian drink? The horchata. The horchata. The horchata is the most famous, right? Now, I give you a, a difficult question. What is the best drink? Okay? You can use the chat for this. The best the drink. The I, will give you three, I will give you three <laughs> options only. Option one, chocolate. Option two, milk. Option three, coffee. What is the most delicious drink in your opinion? In your opinion, right? So for me, for example, for me, the most delicious drink is coffee. For me, for me right? the most now, delicious drink I am... is chocolate coach. Chocolate and chocolate with milk. No, chocolate. Just chocolate. Okay, yeah, got it. Only chocolate. But if you if you have another option and you want to say my uh the the, the most delicious drink is soda. Or you want to say Coca Cola? It's okay. In my opinion, the most famous drink is coffee. Okay, it's not the most famous. It's the most delicious in your opinion, right? Okay, the coffee yes. says Edna. Okay, so the right. most delicious, the most delicious drink. Okay, excellent. So uh, continue you writing your answers in the chat, please, or you can open the microphone, Robin. <laughs> So we're going to, uh, do you have questions about this topic right now, so far? Any questions so far? No? Okay, let's practice, let's practice. Okay, I am going to uh, ask the question and you tell me the answer, okay? Which country is larger, Canada or China? Canada, 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 Canada is larger than China. Larger China, China, China is larger than China. China. Which China. city has the largest population? Tokyo, Mexico City, or Sao Paulo? Tokyo has the largest population of the three. What is the most beautiful mountain in the world? I think, I think most beautiful is the most beautiful mountain Okay. Have you ever seen the Mount Fuji in the pictures or videos about Mount, Mount Fuji in Japan? Nope. No. No. Uh, it is no. beautiful. It is beautiful. So I recommend you to look for some videos or pictures can, about Mount Fuji. Can you describe it? What? Can you describe it? You know, I will do something better than describing it. 
I'm going to show it to you. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. So, as you can see, we have a little exercise that we're going to um, do to complete. Okay. And, uh, but before that, I'm going to show you, right? A little picture about my uh, some Somebody, I don't know, I hear noise like a dog is barking. Really? I didn't hear that. Okay, so right now I'm sharing the Mount Fuji. Can you see the picture? Yeah, I can see. Wow, it's amazing. Yeah, it's a, okay. it's a cool place. Yeah, it's considered to be one of the most beautiful mounts in the world. Okay, uh, so you have some pictures. <laughs> with the sakura trees there, the cherry trees. Okay, so, uh, sure. yeah. So what it's is... a very famous mount uh, around the world, Mount Fuji. Now, um, for, for example, in, around the world we have seven wonders, right? Seven wonders, Las Siete Maravillas, um, of the modern world, the Mundo Moderno. For you, which is the most beautiful of the seven wonders? For me, I I have one. I have one that for me is the best, the most beautiful. Who's playing okay. music? <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. In case you didn't know, I'm going to show you. It's this picture right here. Uh, of the modern world is right here. So we have the Great Wall of China, the Roman Coliseum in Italy, the Taj Mahal in India, Machu Picchu in Peru, Christ the Redeemer in Brazil, Chichen Itza in Mexico, and Petra in Jordan. So which one do you consider, or do you think is the most beautiful from the seven? Um, for me, the it's not the most beautiful, but I want to know this uh, Machu Picchu. For me, this will, could be the For best. Me, Machu Picchu is the most beautiful. Uh, yes. We are the same. That was, my, that was my dream come true. So do I. Yeah. I went there. Who's in, playing some, music? Some, somebody's doing aerobics, I think. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, so, yes. Uh, in my opinion, much a picture, right? But you can write your opinion in the chat. The most beautiful uh, of the seven wonders for me is the Great Wall of China. You can see. Hey, if somebody don't want to stay here, okay. leave. Okay. Now me. we're going to move on, and here we go with the exercise. So just pay attention. Okay. Um, all right. So we have the. Exercise A, okay, complete the questions one to four with comparatives and questions five to eight with superlatives. Then ask and answer the questions, okay? So right now we're going to practice completing the questions and then we're going to practice answering the questions, okay? So question number one, which country is, and the adjective in parentheses is small, Monaco or Vatican City? What is what do you think is a compliment here for number one? Smaller. 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 Which country is smaller? Smaller. smaller. Correct. Number two. Which waterfall is high? The highest. Higher. 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 Yes. Highest. Niagara Falls or Angel Falls? That's a, an interesting question. Number three, which city is, the adjective is crowded? Okay, it's no, not crowded. Not crowded. Not crowded. Not crowded. Say, which city is? More crowded. More crowded. More crowded. More crowded. More crowded. crowded. More yes. crowded. Which city is more crowded? Hong Kong or Cairo? Number four, which mm. lake is large? What is the adjective? Larger. Larger. The, the, the highest. Larger. Larger. 
Which lake is the highest? More larger. No, it's larger. Larger, see. Yes. Larger, sorry. Okay, I had a little, had a little um, technical issue here, but I already got it. <laughs> so, which lake is? Larger. 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 Larger, correct. Larger. The Caspian Sea or Lake Superior. Okay, which lake is larger? Now, for five, six, seven, and eight, we are going to use superlatives. Okay, highest, superlatives. longest, highest. more expensive, which is the, the highest. High. highest. Which is the highest. 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 Yes, you, you, studied, highest. you studied this. I like it. Okay. Uh, the highest, Mount Aconcagua, Mount Everest, or Mount Fuji. Now, number six. The Everest. What is? Longest. Long. Long. Longest. The longest. longest. The longest. What is the longest river longest. in the world? The Nile or the Amazon? Hmm. The, the Amazon. See your knowledge on general topics, let's say, or general culture. Let's go with uh, which city is expensive? The most, the most expensive. expensive. The, the most, most expensive. expensive. The most expensive. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Which city Moscow. is the most expensive? Yeah. Tokyo, Moscow, or Hong Kong? I think it's Moscow. Uh, all right. One of them is correct. Now, let's continue with number eight. The what is most deep? deep? The deepest. Deeper. Huh? Deepest. 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 What deepest. is the deepest ocean, ocean. in ocean. the world? Ocean. The Pacific yeah. or the Atlantic? Hmm. The Atlantic. Okay. Thing. So uh, right now we are going to practice, okay, in the breakout rooms in small groups. So you can ask different questions. And if you know the answer, you give the answer. If you don't know, you can Google, right? <laughs> and just share the answer, okay? This is exercise is to practice, but also to learn and discover information about the world, okay? So it's important, it's important to know about this. Now, uh, for example, do you know what is, what the name of the highest building in the world? El nombre del edificio más alto del mundo. El Burj Khalifa. Burj Khalifa, okay, correct. Mm -hmm. So that's correct, uh, Edmund. Now we're going to go to the breakout rooms for this final exercise. Please take a screenshot. If not, I will uh, I will send you the picture to the group so that you have the, ah, oh, you already have the picture, Brandy here. Okay, thank you so much, Brandy. Now we're going to the breakout room for the last, uh, let's see, four minutes maximum. Just try to practice and answer the questions, okay? Um, I will create just, or yeah, four breakout rooms. So you can ask different questions and answer the questions, okay, in groups. Okay, here we go. Okay, ready, set, and wait a second. I will create just four. Go. Once you have the answers and the correct answer, we come back, okay, to say goodbye and take the picture, <laughs> okay. Go to the breakout room, go to the breakout rooms quickly. Ask and answer the questions, okay? This is a little trivia. All right, Isaura, Norma, and Nelson, you can join the breakout rooms.
Saura. Hi, teacher. Hello. Do you get an invitation to join the breakout room? I don't know. My my cell phone is filed today. Okay, I'm going to send you to another room one more time. Okay. Nope. Okay, it seems that you have some problems with the with the cell phone probably. Hello. Hello. Uh, I have problem with my cell phone. Okay, with your cell phone. So, uh, what we can do is just to try to answer the questions here, okay? So, Isaura, you, and me. So, question number one. Which country is smaller, Monaco or Vatican City? Norma, is that right? Hello. 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 <laughs> okay, question one. Which country okay. is smaller, Monaco or Vatican City? Mm. I think it's Monaco. I don't Monaco. know. <laughs> uh -huh. It's smaller than Vatican City. Okay, you need to investigate. You need to investigate. This is just practice, right? <laughs> Number two, which waterfall is higher, Niagara Falls or Angel Falls? Niagara Falls is higher than Angel Falls. Angel Falls, okay. Three, which city is more crowded, Hong Kong or Cairo? Cairo is more crowded than crowded Hong Kong. Than Hong Kong. Crowded than Maybe. Hong Kong. Maybe. No. Which <laughs> lake is is uh larger, the Caspian Sea or Lake Superior? The Lake Superior is larger than Caspian Sea. Okay. And uh, which is the highest mountain? It is the highest, the Mount Aconcagua, Mount Everest, or Mount Fuji? The highest. You can just say, I think that Mount Everest is the highest. Okay. And then you go like that, right? With number six, seven, eight. So. You need to investigate, okay? That's your homework. <laughs> investigate okay. the correct answers for these questions, okay? It's okay. to learn about, about the world, right? About the world. Now we're going to wait for the rest of your classmates to come back. And we're going to take the, the, the picture. Right, we're ready for the group picture. Let's wait, let's wait. All right, so it's picture time. Okay, uh, if you didn't answer the questions or you didn't find the correct answer for all the questions, investigate, okay? On Monday, we can share a little bit about the answers, uh, the real answer, right? So do a little Google research there, a, a Google search, sorry, and then we're going to share.
Okay, so we're gonna take the picture. Uh, if you see, if you have a nice shot, also you can take it and then you share it in the in the WhatsApp group. Okay, so I'm gonna take one in three, two, one. Everybody, camera on, please. Camera on. It's not camera on. No, camera on. Okay. Now let's see. Ready, set, Colgate smile, and here we go. In a second, I'm going to share it in the chat. You can take a screenshot if you want, no problem, and then you share the picture with us. All right, I have that one there. And that's the end of the week number three. Okay, so you can show the number three like that with your fingers. <laughs> okay. Like that, yeah. One, two, and three. Wait a second. I will take the screenshot. Three, two, one. Nice. Okay, so we did it. Have a great weekend, everybody. I hope to see you on Monday. Okay, God willing. Enjoy, rest, uh, do what you like to do, right? Uh, what you enjoy doing. And if possible, right, dedicate a little moment to practice English. Not homework, practice, okay, practice. Uh, Which color so, for oh, Monday? What? Which color for Monday? White. <laughs> Which color for Monday? White. White. Yes. Okay. You will no. choose the color, you will choose the color on Thursday for the picture. <laughs> okay, okay, Love I will. Color. So let's go with white, okay? Let's go with white. If somebody okay, wants... guys, take care of yourself. And um, it was nice to be with you this week as well. So see you soon. See you Monday. Uh, see you Monday. Good night, Jasmine. You have a good weekend. Take care. Happy weekend. Bye. Blessings for all. Yes, happy weekend for you too. Thank you.